Are you really making your own choices, or is your brain making them before you even know it? What if free will is just an illusion? Jean-Paul Sartre, the existentialist philosopher, once said, Man is condemned to be free. He believed we are not shaped by fate, gods, or biology, but by our actions. Even doing nothing is a choice. To Sartre, freedom is absolute. But that also means we carry the full weight of our decisions. No excuses. No one to blame. But then science showed up with a curveball. In the 1980s, neuroscientist Benjamin Leibert ran an experiment that turned philosophy on its head. He hooked people up to brain monitors and asked them to press a button whenever they felt like it. The shocking part? Their brains showed signs of preparing the movement before they were consciously aware of deciding. Milliseconds before the choice, the brain had already made it. Later studies confirmed it. The brain often acts before we know we've chosen. So, is free will just a story we tell ourselves? Some neuroscientists think we're just passengers watching our brain drive the car. But others point out something powerful. Even if the impulse begins unconsciously, we may still have the power to veto it. To say no. Maybe that's where free will lives. Not in initiating the choice, but in resisting it. A fragile freedom. But maybe the most human one we have.